Where do you go to put a smile on your face? Bring your entire family to JR's. JR's doesn't just stop at ribs, excellent seafood, OC's best all lump crab cakes, barbecue chicken, and a great kids menu. JR's Sports Bar, Ocean City's newest sports bar, and the loud and proud home of Raven's Nest 23. Carry out rib and chicken tubs at our new JR's Express drive thru. Order meal deals or buckets of special recipe, one of a kind chicken. Once you try us, we gotcha. Welcome to Assateague Island, an unspoiled sanctuary on the eastern shore. Come explore the wonders of Mother Nature in your own backyard. A 37-mile-long barrier island located off the eastern coast of Maryland. It is best known for its herds of wild ponies, pristine beaches, and the Assateague Lighthouse. Historians believe that in the spring of 1524, on the ship La Dauphine, Florentine navigator Giovanni de Verrazzano came ashore here during his quest for a route to Asia. Now the gateway over the beautiful Assawoman Bay bears the name of this explorer and his brother, the map maker. There are several local legends about the origins of the ponies on Assateague. The most popular is that the ponies swam ashore from a Spanish galleon that had run aground. As recently as 1997, a Spanish shipwreck was discovered off of Assateague Island, lending credibility to this legend. Another story has it that the ponies came from a wrecked ship that had been on its way to the English colonies, and a third claims that pirates brought the ponies to the island. Although the ponies are small in stature, standing usually around 12 hands high, they do feature some horse-like characteristics, which indicates that they are descendants of early horses. The ponies may show up just about anywhere on Assateague. On the refuge, it's most likely that you'll spot them in the marshes on the south side of the island's main road. The Assateague Island National Seashore was established in 1965 to preserve the barrier island, surrounding waters, and provide recreational opportunities. Assateague Island's pristine beaches offer swimming, beachcombing, fishing, and many other activities for the voyager looking to get away from it all. The island's bayside offers explorers an opportunity to venture beyond the roadways for a quiet adventure in the secluded coves and marsh areas among the sika deer, waterfowl, and feral horses via kayak, canoes, bicycling, or hiking. Come and explore the wonders of Assateague Island, the paradise of the eastern shore. Improving, preserving, enhancing. These are just a few of the ways the Ocean City Development Corporation is leading the charge to revitalize downtown Ocean City. The OCDC was established in 2000. The OCDC is an organization that works together with downtown business owners, downtown residents, and the Marin City Council to develop projects to bring forward for approval by the Marin City Council. It's their ability to gain consensus in the downtown community for projects before they're brought forward that has allowed the town of Ocean City to pass design guidelines for South and Third Street, for land acquisition, and also for a facade improvement program, all to better downtown Ocean City. After many years of little private investment in existing buildings or new projects in the downtown area, this not-for-profit charitable organization has turned that scenario around by promoting new development, renovating older buildings, adding attractive works of art, creating new public spaces, and expanding special event activities. These projects are bringing new life, vitality, and activity to this oldest section of Ocean City. While the downtown Ocean City has seen significant new development over the past decade, the OCDC recognizes the need to improve the appearance of existing buildings. As of June 2011, more than 105 buildings have participated in the OCDC's facade improvement program and have been renovated. Many more buildings are currently being improved, and a number of other facade projects are in the works. The Facade Improvement Program, funded by the Maryland Department of Housing and Community Development, requires exterior improvements that enhance the immediate building as well as the surrounding neighborhoods. Commercial, residential, and mixed-use buildings are eligible for the program. Special events continue to be a mainstay of attracting tourists and residents to the downtown area. 
For the past several summers, the OCDC has teamed with the town of Ocean City to offer a variety of concerts every week throughout the summer at Sunset Park, located along South Division Street and the Bay. Sunset Park, located on the Bay at South Division Street, was completed in 2006. What was once a dead-end street is now a well-landscaped pedestrian way that plays host to concerts, festivals, and even just a leisurely stroll along the Bay. Free concerts are provided this summer at Sunset Park every Thursday in July and August. The White Marlin Festival and Crab Soup Cook-Off, sponsored by the Downtown Association, takes place the second Saturday of May on Somerset Street and features many local restaurants showcasing their masterpiece crab soups. And the OC Cruisers organization displays its classic and custom cars every other Sunday afternoon at the Somerset Plaza during the summer. There's no risk at high stakes in Fenwick Island. Everyone wins with year-round live entertainment, a great menu, and takeout with the world's best Philly cheesesteak. All food items are under $12. Support your team with plenty of big screen TVs, NFL tickets, and enter to win one of our football jersey raffles. Our staff is friendly. All ages are welcome. There's tons of parking, and we are open year-round. You're all in at high stakes. Thank you for calling Doctors Medical Center. We're closed. Please listen carefully as our prompts have changed. To hear our hours of service, address, or fax number, press 1. To learn about our patient appreciation program, press 2. If you're calling with a medical question, please press 3. Please listen carefully as our prompts have changed. Hi, this is 75th Street Medical. How can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. 75th Street Medical, providing urgent care and family medicine to the community for over 19 years. BJ's on the water at 75th Street in the Bay, Ocean City is still the same. BJ's entire menu is offered from 11 a.m. until 1.30 in the morning. Still the same generous cocktails, the best raw bar in town, daily lunch and dinner specials, live entertainment, and no cover charge ever. Happy hour Monday through Friday from 4 to 7, duck feeding daily, and that fabulous bayfront view. It's still the same. BJ's on the water at 75th Street in the Bay, Ocean City. Now is the perfect time to get your deck or patio ready for summer entertaining and outdoor living. Tyndall's Casual Furniture has the largest display of casual furniture to help you create resort living in your own backyard. Buy Made in America from Tyndall's Casual Furniture, specializing in Made in America brands like Lloyd Flanders, Resesta, and Telescope Casual. For Delmarva's largest selection of in-stock inventory ready for immediate delivery, visit Tyndall's Casual Furniture in Laurel or Lewis today. Made in America and tax-free from Delaware. Mackey's Bayside Bar and Grill, where life is good, on 54th Street and the Bay. Enjoy bayfront dining, inside or outside. Our unique beach atmosphere, tables in the sand, beautiful palm trees and flowers, all make Mackey's truly unforgettable. We are family friendly, so feel free to let the kids play and explore the beach while you relax with one of our signature frozen drinks. Our lunch menu has a variety of fantastic sandwiches, mouth-watering wraps, crisp salads, and original burgers. Hang out at the bar or in the lounge for happy hour and enjoy awesome food and drink specials. Still hungry? Our dinner menu includes flavorful pastas, tender steak, and seafood specials with fish so fresh you'll want to slap it. With so many delicious items to choose from, just ask our knowledgeable and friendly staff to assist you. They will gladly be of service, making sure that your dining experience is one of a kind. Get your cameras ready for Mackey's Famous Sunsets, accompanied by Kate Smith's God Bless America, an Ocean City tradition since 1994. 
After the sun goes down, enjoy your hot meal and frosty beverage under the stars and glowing lights on the beach. After dinner, Mackey's Lounge turns into a dance floor with live bands and DJs to keep you rocking all night long. Take part in Mackey's exciting events Monday through Sunday, like Thursday's Little Black Dress Night. We're serving up something special on Sundays, so stop in for Sunday brunch and our incredible Bloody Mary bar. With a beautiful beach, amazing food, and warm smiling faces, make your next dining destination Mackey's Bayside Bar and Grill, 54th Street and the Bay. For all your fun under the sun, your vacation starts on Beach Television. You're watching BTV. In this segment of Day Tripping, we're here in lovely Dorchester County. There's a lot to love here in Dorchester County, the heart of the Chesapeake. From boating, to cycling, to eating local seafood, Dorchester makes for a beautiful escape and it's just an hour west of Ocean City. Dorchester has more shoreline than any other Maryland county, so it's easy to get out on the water. One of the best ways is to join a sail on the Skipjack, Nathan of Dorchester, on the beautiful Chop Tank River. The Skipjack is Maryland's state boat, so there's a lot of history caught up in those sails. You'll hear stories of watermen, see an oyster dredge in action, and you might even get a turn at the helm. You can also explore Dorchester's waterways on your own by kayak or boat or join in the fun of a paddle wheeler dinner cruise, a romantic sunset cruise, or a fishing charter. Or come in October for the Cambridge Schooner Rendezvous when majestic tall ships gather here. One of the most scenic ways to get around Dorchester County is by bicycle. The roads are flat and quiet and the scenery is gorgeous. Pick up a cycling guide at the Dorchester Visitor Center and try out rides from five to 80 miles. If you love nature, Blackwater National Wildlife Refuge is known around the world for its 30,000 acres of dramatic marshland. Check out the refuge's wildlife, drive by car, by foot, or by bicycle, and you're bound to see bald eagles, herons, egrets, and ospreys. Hungry yet? Head to historic downtown Cambridge where everybody's buzzing about the restaurant scene. Not one, but two chefs were finalists for statewide Chef of the Year honors. Be sure to have a crab cake or oysters while you're here. Just about every restaurant has delicious local crab meat and oysters on the menu. Come for the day, come for the weekend. Find out more about Dorchester County, the heart of the Chesapeake, at tourdorchester.org or call 800-522-TOUR. Welcome to the Ward Museum. Hi, I was actually looking at all the sculptures and are they new? They are, they're just part of the many new additions to the museum since your last visit. They're great and you know what, I love Charming Charlie. <laughs> Why don't you come inside and cool off and I can show you some more. Absolutely. Wow, this is really spectacular. And what can you tell me about this besides I can't live in there even though I'd like to? Yes, it's an exact replica of a Chesapeake Bay decoy company, including all the, the carvers and the wild fowl, their carvings, and right down to the last detail. Really amazing. The first highlight of our championship gallery is the bald eagle. Wow, this is actually amazing. First off, the size of it. I didn't realize they get that big. They do. And then the craftsmanship, everything, the detail, all of it. Yes, all carved by hand. And the fe notice the feathering technique that is mm -hmm. outstanding. Probably done with a wood burner. In 1948, the Ward brothers were unknown outside Crisfield. They were simply two brothers who cut hair and carved decoys in their spare time. This is the Ward brothers' gallery, Lemon Steve Ward became quite famous, but lived their entire lives in Crisfield, Maryland, and carved over a period of about 50 years. John, can you tell me about this beautiful piece of art? Yes, this is a gyral falcon at one end, and two turns, it's all carved from a big piece of walnut, and it was done by a husband and wife team. The Ward Museum in Salisbury, Maryland is a great day trip to bring your whole entire family, or even yourself, because there's plenty to do. This is our lobby area with a fantastic view of the Shoemaker Pond and an observation deck where you can observe the wildfowl 
and a nature trail. It is 909 South Shoemaker Drive, Salisbury, Maryland. Plug that into your GPS and they'll see you at the Warp Museum.